Hello and welcome to October the 20th on a very wet windy Sunday. Um, I mean we haven't got it as bad as some people up the north way and um, I hope you're all okay and uh, nothing's got damaged. Uh, yeah, um, <laughs> from the COVID and flu jab, I feel worse t today than I did yesterday. Um, throat feels more sore, I've got more of a runny nose, and I just feel yuck. I really feel yuck. So, and the temperature. So, I'm hoping tomorrow is going to be, I feel better from that. But, you know, it could be more worse than that so I'm thankful that's all I've got um I'm sorry I've just uploaded um Fridays and Saturdays this morning well this afternoon I can I really thought um that I'd uploaded it um because I did the editing in bed and yeah, I don't know why I didn't upload it, but I apologise. Um, but I hope you, you know, like them. Um, before I talk on, um, if you can, if you like them, can you like for me? That'd be really lovely. And if also subscribe, um, yeah, it'd be really lovely if you can do that for me. I'd really appreciate it. So I don't say that very often, um, but yeah, it'd be nice. So I've just been watching a vlog, which I um, watch regularly. If you love narrowboats, which I do, um, it's a couple called Ben and Emily, and um, they, they're just lovely and um they're just so laid back and yeah they're just really really good and their vlogs are brilliant absolutely brilliant and yeah i mean for years i you know going back to when i was younger um that was one of my things i would love to knit, live on a narrow boat obviously it's never going to happen now but that was one of my dreams um i've been on a narrow boat once and we went um my ex's parents rented one for a weekend and we went for the day and um i loved it i really loved it but yeah that oh, that would have been my dream but never mind um, but it's lovely watching these two. Um, yeah, so I highly recommend if you're into that sort of thing, go and have a have a watch. Um, the cardigan. No, why did I say cardigan? Where's that come from? Um, my Christmas jumper, the Joel Grum. Yeah since obviously having the cataracts done um i haven't even attempted to do it in bed so i thought when i got to you know what i'm going to take that down with me and let's get on with it so um what have you got i've got oh hang on i've got two more rows and then i'm on the trunk so the yarn is paint box yarns and the dye lot, God, I was doing so well, wasn't I before? 132. Let's get it to the, the wrong side is the right side. Let's get the picture up for you. By Andy Satterland. So 
there we go let's put it out a bit so you can see the tree so yeah uh, the paint box yarn knits up so lovely and it is the first time i've used it um and for me i highly recommend it uh, not being sponsored as usual um but yeah it's a lovely knit but i'm so happy now i'm co near come to that end of the, the pattern and uh, i just want to get onto that rib get that done and get the sleeves and the, the neck part done for christmas so yeah i'll do some more of that after this um I went on because every day yarn pond comes up because of the um, test knit that I did on the oh it was a shawl what was it called it was by hand knits by Sam oh, it's so annoying I can't remember it um, and every day when it comes on the emails I always check and there's a lovely sweater on there today, which it's got to be done by January, but it's such a lovely jumper. But I don't know if I'd get it completed in time for the designer. Um, because I don't know when this size is going to be dealt with um let me see if i can show you it it's just so pretty really pretty uh, let's have a look oops sorry guys there it is It's so, it's a simple look to it, but I just love it. I love the variegated bit that she's got in there. Look at that. Isn't that gorgeous? Um, so I don't know if I should go try for it or not. Um, I'm so tempted. yeah i don't i honestly don't know but i love it i really love it um i think that would be nice in an oatmeal color do you think of the king cold tweed how nice that would look we'll see we'll see i mean this eye the right eye that i've had the cataracts done um I'm nearly, nearly there, but I think if it if it weren't for this blimmin' eye now, it would look good. Um, but this is putting it out. <laughs> um, yeah, it's horrible at the moment. Um, walking around and even long distance, it's a nightmare. Um, yeah if only you could have both of them done at the same time but yeah yeah but i know i'd be like falling over everywhere but yes it's so frustrating um so that's the bunny they've been they're out well aggie's back in i'll have to do a video of them um i'll see how i feel tomorrow i'll do a little video um i did some cross stitch last night only did a little bit um because of obviously the size still repairing a little bit what did i what did, oh. i thought something dropped maybe not so collection tra la la and I'm doing the witchy witch. Oh, 
Ooh. Here are the threads. Classic colour works. that so you can see right, okay so I completed the star so now I am going to Let's have a look Where's my pattern So next I'm going to do another pumpkin, so let me show you, I think there's a bigger picture on here, let's have a look. sad thing about it there's not a proper picture of the main the whole of it that you can see but yeah there's a let's see what the one's like it's just like where are we that one there but on the other side so yeah I'm gonna do that with 20 days only 11 more days of working on this um so i'm not sure if it will get completed or should i just leave it down here because i forgot three more pumpkins no four more pumpkins and Three stars. We'll see. We'll see. It seems a shame to put it up and I'm nearly there, doesn't it? But yeah, I'm going to start the pumpkin today. I just don't want to push it because of the eye. Um, another thing, I did some of the gold work. So. Get a picture up for you. I don't know if I've got a picture in here. Let's have a look. If not, I'll put it on my phone. I'd have to pick one up actually. Be a good idea. I've even got a advent um, it's a little bit of money it's not worth it so obviously it's the money and I've only just gone back into it so uh, let's find it where is it come on
sorry about this. I'm not too keen on the oh there we go around that finding the bits on the web. Oh you know how it is. Oh I don't want the beetle. Royal Mail. I didn't know Royal Mail posted green their vans on a Sunday. I've never seen that before on a Sunday. Oh, this is ridiculous. Wow. Come on. I'm going to leave it on there once I found it. Take the picture. They've got a lovely cockle on there for a um, starter. I like that. Got a little beginner. So I took it down now. So sorry. Find it now. Ah, it's still coming up as an await awaiting list, but there we go. So I'm doing the raise bits at the moment. I'm going to leave that on there. I'm going to take a photo. <laughs> I've got to go through all that to show you again. Um, so, you're watching your old. It's just here. I've put this large piece in there now. So, next we'll leave that and then that. So, yeah. Get in there. But I, I even love doing this part. Um... It's just so enjoyable. So yeah, there we go. Oh, oh, I forgot down there what else. Oh. Uh, what else? Oh, I've done um, another row, sorry, of my sock, which I'll show you in a minute. It's just like a peek of my tea. So these are the Autumn Retreat socks by Nicola Fury. There you go, we numbered it. And I'm on the first slot of the leaves. Uh, the yarn is Pumpkin Patch from Craft House Magic. So that's the main. Mm. 
this one using the cuff. The needles are 2.5. Oh, and this is the leaf colour. This is Heather and Hop's Audrey, taken after a cat. One leaf already. Got a couple of um, rows on the main now. There you go. But I think that looks really nice. Really pretty. So soft, it's lovely yarn. Oh yeah, and also, silly me. Um, I'm because it's grown a bit now. I'm starting to stitch the pico down. There it is. Isn't that pretty? So yeah, I'm on that. So yeah, I'm glad I've managed to do a little bit of that. And the blanket. Um, so I'm on the second week. And... Um, I've done Kep the Collie and now I'm on Jemima Puddle Duck. And oh, sorry, this is Olivia Talks, the Windermere blanket based on Beatrix Potter. And then I got the Wendy pack. He's got his chin on my lap. You got your chin on my lap, little boy. Yeah. Looking after mummy, aren't you? So, there it is. I'll try it, Wally. But I just love the look. Of that row so pretty and so there I've literally joined on the grape for Jemima Puddle Duck so there you go so get another of that done today oh that's heavy um, another thing, oh, I'll leave it there, oh, um, another thing, Abby, um, they went out yesterday, and she got a Halloween, um, outfit for Winnie, and it's a Wednesday outfit, took from the Adams family, <laughs> oh my, she FaceTimed me, and Winnie's got plaits, it's a, a woolen wig, black, with the plaits, and um, the little dress, and oh, she looks so cute, and I said to her, I said, she looks like me, <laughs> she's, a, oh, it's just adorable, so, I said to Abby, please take a photo, so I can show um, you lovely people, um, so I'm going to insert it here. But oh, so cute. Really cute. And like I said, well, he's yet to have his T-shirt on. Um, I completely forgot about today. Um, if I leave it up somewhere after this, this, I have, it's over there. Um, and I'll get it on him and show you tomorrow. 
but oh she looks adorable absolutely adorable and um abby went to a dash and meet up oh a little while ago and um they're doing another one and they've all got to be in halloween fancy dress and the best one gets a prize so obviously winnie's gonna be wednesday um but oh they should have a chihuahua one, shouldn't they? Wally, would you like that? Hey? Wouldn't that be lovely? Um, so yeah, that's just so cute, really cute. Um, I think that's it for today, because I'll see the way I'm feeling as well. Um, so tomorrow, I'll do a video of the bunnies depending on how I'm feeling and pumpkin top on for Wally and uh, yeah and have a little chat so I hope you've enjoyed your Sunday and uh, I hope you have a good start to your Monday and I will see you tomorrow take care thank you for watching bye hello so it's Monday the 21st of October can you believe there's only 10 days left of this month it's just flying by isn't it it really is so I've got a lovely cup of tea so I'll take a sip of that And um, I just want to hang on. Sorry, get them. Put that there. That's it. So Wally has got his pumpkin top on. Look at that face. <laughs> and it just fits in well. So shall we share everybody, Wally? Is that okay? So this is just so embarrassing. So. Let's have a look. Can I turn you round? Good boy. Can we just give a cuddle? Look at him. Doesn't he look cute? You look cute. You said I don't need this to look cute. No, you don't. But you do. So what do you think, Susan? Doesn't he look cutie? I'm going to take it off him now because he'll get warm. But um, yeah, he looks so cute. Oh, nearly there, Wally. Can we slip it off? Let's do this little paw first. Good boy. He was so good, let me put it on him. Yeah, you're getting warm, aren't you? It's really fleecy. Is that nice? So, yeah, it's better off than on. So, I had a lovely, well, lovely gifts um, come this morning from the lovely Sarah. Hi, Sarah, who at the moment is on our holly bobs. Um, so, she made an outfit, Halloween outfit for Patty. It's just gorgeous. Oh, don't care. Where we got to pick you up, Patty. So, she made this gorgeous cloak. Look at that gorgeous button. But look, it fits so perfectly. I just love it. And then, she got this little hat. Doesn't it suit? Let's show you your eye a bit, Patty. I think it needs to go on the back bit like that. There you go. Oh, look at her. And I said to Sarah, I don't think I can take it off after Halloween. It's too cute. Do you know what, Sarah? If it's okay with you, I think I'm going to put a band of ribbon around here and put some flowers at the side. What do you think? Yeah, I think we need to do that, Sarah. But, oh, she just adore. It does look adorable. And Sarah made this 
Patty um, company for me um, and she's oh she's just one of my favourites she really is she's really lovely so honestly Sarah thank you so much Patty is happy so that's that oh, you can stay there there you go but also Sarah is so what's the word more than clever at her crafting um honestly look at this she's done her diamond painting look at that isn't that cute and it's on a stand oh, it's just so clever so is that and I'm going to um, make room and put it on my mantelpiece. But look at this. Oh. It's just, oh, it's falling down to pick it up. But this blew me away. Look at that. Isn't that beautiful? How long that must have took her. Really stunning. So what I'm going to do, um, I don't know if you can see from here, it'd be that way. Where I've got the quilt here, I'm going to put this wreath there and the quilts can be moved along because oh, that's just exquisite. And Sarah, I can't take that down after um, autumn. It's too pretty to put away. So, um, you know, when my Christmas things come out, it might get moved because I might have a big quilt, um, but it'll be hanging somewhere else around here because it's too pretty. And after Christmas, then it'll come back on this side. But that is beautiful. And then, let me just see if I can get it. Um, reach. Whoop. Oh, there we go. Look at this bookmark. Dolly! Oh, it's just stunning. And a little butterfly at the end. So that's going to go in the book that I'm reading now, Sarah. That is just beautiful. And then, honestly, I said I feel so spoilt today, really spoilt. Um, look at this. Get the Christy bag. The mouse trap is one of my favourite um, stories. But look at look, it's all on there. It's just amazing. And on the same on the other side. Whoops, mouse trap. Sarah, I've never seen like this. I've never seen anything like this. And I love it. I absolutely love it. I'm FaceTiming Beth today. I can't wait to show her all these. Thank you so much, Sarah. Honestly, I really appreciate it. It's so lovely of you. And um, me and Sarah are gonna have a little FaceTime um, catch up tomorrow which is going to be lovely so mwah, thank you my darling really really lovely of you I feel like I'm right on the end here hang on it's because Eddie's here 
um, I think I've said it before, just lately he just wants to be laying by my side. Um, even in bed, um, when I woke up, oh, I think it was about five this morning. And uh, he was laying this side and then he came round and he just snuggled into me. And uh, we were just having a cuddle. It was just so lovely. So yeah, he's getting uh, very snuggly with me. Aren't you, bub? I don't know where he's gone. He's going, I'm gone, I'm gone. I ain't sure putting that on me again. Um, so, um, I did a bit more on my Joel Grant. Oh, sorry, Patty. You're leaning on now, aren't you? And I showed you the wrong side, Jesse. I was going to, I was saying the right side, the pearl side's the right side, and I showed you the wrong side, so I'm sorry about that. And I've put my pumpkins on now. I thought, oh, I better make the most of this because, you know, we've only got 10 more days to go on there. So I've got two more rows of the trunk and then I'm on the rib. There we go. And show you the trunk if I can it's just there so yeah I'm really happy so um hopefully finish those the two rows of the trunk um tonight and get that rib started so that's that Did a bit of the cross stitch. I think my eye is there now. Um, it's in the centre of my um, left eye though now because the cataracts is literally, in, she did say mine are in the middle, the bit back of the eye. And yeah, I, I can definitely see, see that. Um, it's horrible. Um, but I've booked my post check. And uh, so, how many have I got? About three weeks. And yeah, because it's a week on Wednesday that I had it done. Um, so yeah, I'll just be glad to get this sorted and just even them, even them up um but yeah the right eye is definitely there and do you think that's done that's under a week and it's settled already um obviously i'm doing the eye drops like i've got to do um but yeah i'm so happy about it really so yeah highly recommend it i really really do He's back, he's looking out the window. What's that? I've got half of a pumpkin done. colouring on that one, I really do. So <clears throat> I'll finish that one today and then I'll do the next pumpkin. Yeah. 
You're right, Wally. Um, I just done my socks. Oh, Wells, what are you doing? Wally. <laughs> oh, Wells. You're listening to me. Oh, you are listening to me. Come on. Where did you go? Me? Where did you go? Yes. You've been outside, you've got cold paws. Yeah. Yeah. Good boy. Come on then. Right, so. There we go. The whole leaf. Let me show you that side. And I've still got to finish sewing on the pico bit, so I'll have to do that next before I do any more knitting on that. There we go. Let's put that needle in there. Um, I did some of the gold work again. Let's get the picture up for you. I've printed it out. Sorry, darling. So, for the pumpkin um, backing is complete now, and now here I've got to do um, some over sewing on. It's a clear, uh, a transparent uh, wire. Now there wasn't any in that bag um, that I bought the kit. So I'm going to look in my box, um, if not, I'm going to look, because I've got a lot of beading stuff that I used to, because I used to do a lot of bead work, and I'm sure I've got some in there. Um, so yeah, it will be literally um, having a length of it, and then I just keep going over it, and you bring the wire around, and you go round and round. And that can completes that part. So yeah, really happy with that. So I'll probably do some of that this afternoon. Um, <laughs> the Ophelia talks wind me a blanket. I've gone wrong. So I'm on week two um, and I showed you the first row and I said, oh, this is so pretty. I've done it wrong. Um, it's because of how I read it. And then when I, because I weren't sure about the next row, so I thought I'll watch the video. And then when I saw her row that I'd done wrong, I thought, oh, no. So let me show you. So I had to put it all back. Oh, my hook's gone off. It's been there. <laughs> so This is how it, it reads. Hang on. Um, one double crochet around the chain space. 
one double crochet on top of the stitch below. No, he thinks it's his blanket. Get off. <laughs> I do like it. You get comfortable. Cheeky. You've got your own blanket. So, I put one around the chain space, but then I put one on the stitch below. That's how I read it, but it's not. I don't, but it's that stitch. See, I, that, that's where I, I, how I thought it, but yeah, one on the stitch below, and that's what she means there, on top there. So yeah, so I've done that much. Um, so I've got to do that again today. Let me know if that's how you would have thought it. Fran, yeah, how did you read that? I bet you got it right, didn't you? So that'll teach me, won't it, for not watching the video. Showing off I was. Oh, let me have a drink of my tea. So, I um, <laughs> I was scrolling through Etsy, you know, like I do. So I thought I've got something for my eye. And um, in there came up um, wall top advent. So let's have a look. It was. Um, it started off at £25 and you've got, it's a 12 day one and you've got a variety of mira, mira, merinos, Muranos, whatever. And I thought, how lovely is that? Because each one that I open, I'll spin and then add the next one. And I just love that idea and um, the read up was lovely and I messaged her and I said would I be able to knit with that after it's spun and she said definitely and she said the variety that you get in there is silks and you know you've got them right and I said yeah I'm definitely going to order it so she put a discount code in for me and i got it for 21 pounds something how good is that um so yeah by the sounds of it that came out oh I, i'm not sure if september or before that because they'd already was posting them out i think the beginning of october so i should get it but obviously it's for christmas so what I'm going to do with that, I'm going to start it on the 12th day and go through there because um, my Stitch by Mrs. D Bear, it'll be a little girl this time, um, will finish on the 12th. So then that'll take me through. Um, so yeah, I just think it's just a lovely item and some of them that i was looking at after seeing that one were over a hundred pounds but yeah i'm quite happy with this one and i'm really looking forward to opening them and seeing the color and you know just the texture so yeah that's written to spin it every day that's going to be so exciting so i'm really looking forward to that but um Oh, a few days ago I'd made this order on Etsy so first of all I got some more wax melt and this one's in a slab and it um, cinnamon buns as always and this was $1.99 and 
Wycliffe aromas. And they're on Etsy. And there. Um, I was watching So Ray Me, and um, she was showing her um, progress keepers. And one of them was a pumpkin bell, little bell one. And that's just adorable. And when I looked through the rest of the shop, she had a Santa and snowmen one. And I thought, I'll grab the Santa. Look at these. And this was the only the other day. It's so quick delivery. Sorry about the jingle, but I just love it. But look. Isn't he cute? And there's Santa. And these were three pounds each. Um, I think it was three. But I and they're good size. I didn't expect to be that big. They're lovely. So yeah, I really love it. I'll, I'll be using this after Halloween. Because it is still autumn, isn't it? What date is it? November, we changed to winter. I think it's near the end, isn't it? Um, is it the 20 something? I'll have to check. Um, but yeah, that's just so cute. Um, so, I think I've shown you all of my todays. Um, I've took um, a video of Bramwell and Aggie um, and they were, when I went to go and do the video, they were laying just outside by the back door. They'd done their running around and jumping in the garden um, and th that's where they normally lay and rest um, to take a breather. And uh, they're back in now. They've had some carrot. They're back in. Um, but yeah, I just wanted to give you a little update and show you them. So they're happy bunnies. Um, yeah, I think that's it for today. So you will see me tomorrow. Obviously, I'll be uploading this today. Um, and yeah. So take care. Thank you for watching. Bye. So here they are. There's Aggie in the front and Graham well. Let's take it in a little bit like that. There we go. They've been wandering around the garden. Well, the little garden that they're allowed to. And they're just having a little rest here. Oh, are you coming in, Grammy? Thank you.